All right, YouTube. Sorry for the delay. I've been busy, you know, doing other things. Uh, gotta get back to the gym and so and so. Uh, check this out. So, I brought y'all the Promate blade on the uh, TI liner. My advice would be to get the GTX. Don't even waste your money on this one. Just get the GTX straight off. The Promate blade is a good blade. It hits, it's sharp, it's super zero gap. You can see that right there. But it doesn't cut. It's like pulled back a hair, which is good. So that's a good blade overall. But check this out right here. I put the GTX blade on my Slimline Pro Ally. Um, he's all over social media. Miami the Barber did this modification, did a how to do it on uh, Barbershop Connect. I post the how to do it um, as soon as I get time to edit. It's just been my, my schedule's been kind of hectic lately. But um, as far as the battle between the GTX and the ProMate, I definitely would say buy the GTX blade. The slight deeper tooth ratio definitely hits all right this thing it hits and this is uh, far less powerful than this okay and this is obviously running on alternating current and this is running on direct current controlled by the switch here but my advice to you would be to get the GTX blade don't really worry about the ProMate the ProMate's a good blade if you want to get that blade go ahead and get this blade it's a good blade. Not that it's not a good blade. It's just that I felt that the GTX blade was hitting a lot more. Maybe it's a deeper tooth groove. I have no idea. But no matter what, at the end of the day, a uh, tool is a tool. Your blade is your blade. And it's the barber that makes the tool at the end of the day. Okay, you have you could have the best tools in the world or the suckiest tools in the world. It's the barber that makes the tool work. So that being said, it's all it's all up to you what you want to get, straight up. But I personally prefer the GTX blade. I've been using this to kind of bald out more. And I've been using this to line up. But I use this one for the kids. This is the original blade. You can see the original blade. For those of you that don't know, this is the original blade. You can see the difference right here. You see how much wider this blade is right here. This is the GTX Andy's blade. This is the regular Slimline Pro Li blade. I use these on the kids and these on pretty much anybody that's uh, got a big enough hairline. I use those. But I have a variety of liners. Let's not drop those. And to be honest, the G these right here hit all the time. No matter what, these hit. But from my standpoint, as you know, going into the professional world of barbering, I would say you're gonna need a variety of liners too. You could probably get away with two liners. Um, one is kind of risky to say I drop this boom my blade shifts then you're SOL you know what I mean you, you don't have anything to line you can use your trimmers you know what I mean but who wants to use this big blade I've done it who wants to use this big blade to, to line up though right um, but have at least two trimmers uh, versatile ones and I suggest having one with a smaller blade for the kids and a wider blade for the adults um, I have again a variety of liners do I need this many probably not to be honest I just grab whatever which one I feel like and what I've noticed is different there's different hair textures and some some of these will hit on certain hair textures for instance this promade blade and the G DTX blade hits super sharp always on textured hair uh, coarse hair curly hair um, uh, these hit on pretty much anything. These definitely, the GTX definitely hits. You know what I mean? But uh, it's again, it's just it's the tool that makes 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 it happen, or it's, it's the barber that makes it happen, and not the tool. All right. So that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, any questions, comments? Uh, just go ahead and uh, put that down below. 
and I will try to get back to my camp. My schedule's been a little bit hectic. Uh, for those of you that don't know, I have a kid. I started getting back to the gym. I picked up uh, reading. Um, just try to expand my knowledge and my, my growth. Uh, and I definitely suggest you guys do that as well. Uh, it's just to expand your horizons, you know. For all you guys, this is Ambitious Cuts out. I'm at, at Ambitious Cuts on IG and obviously at Ambitious Cuts on YouTube. Thank you. Have a good one. Like, comment, subscribe. Uh, peace out. Next video coming up will be Blade Talk. Blade Talk. Oh, and I will be dropping the how to on this. I'm not gonna lie, it was a little bit of a struggle for me to do this. It was a little bit of a struggle. Confusing, confusing. But I will drop the how to. Alright, y'all, this cuts out. Peace.